Tallahassee, Florida Oluwatoyan Salau, a 19-year-old protester who begged for justice in the wake of Black Lives Lost, has died. Her family confirmed the death Monday morning. Salau was found dead Saturday night after she went missing more than a week ago. On June 6, family members told the Tallahassee Democrat of the USA Today Network. Salau was one of two homicide victims discovered Saturday night in southeast Tallahassee. Police identified the suspect as Aaron Glee Jr., 49. Victoria Vicky Sims, 75, who also had been reported missing, is the second victim. She was a retired state worker and grandmother well known for her volunteerism and work in local democratic politics. Oluwatoyan Salau, 19, speaks in front of the Tallahassee Police Department during a protest held Saturday, May 30, 2020. Salau went missing on June 6 and was found dead Saturday, June 13, 2020. Glee was arrested May 30 on a charge of aggravated battery causing bodily harm or disability, according to court records. On June 9, he was arrested on a charge of battery. Salau went missing three days prior, on June 6. She was found dead Saturday night, a family member told the Democrat. The last time Dania Hemphill saw her friend was the day before she went missing. Aaron Glee Jr. In the hours before Salau went missing, she tweeted she had just been sexually assaulted. I had a feeling that we were not going to find Toyan alive, said Hemphill, 22. At each demonstration, Salau had been reciting the names of black people killed, such as Tony McDade of Tallahassee and George Floyd of Minneapolis. I don't want their names gone in vain, Salau said during one protest in front of the Tallahassee Police Department last month. Hemphill didn't think her friend's name would join that list. Toyan was very passionate, said Hemphill. She was very vocal she was very loving, very spiritual, very caring. She was like a light in a dark room. That was Toyan.